The best hacking tools support ethical hackers in system security audits and vulnerability discovery. Therefore, if you are new to the hacking world, you should be aware of these top hacking tools, which are very useful for security audits and for breaking into any system by identifying its weaknesses. You can do security research, develop your hacking abilities, break into wireless devices, and discover flaws with the aid of these hacker tools. These hacker toolkits were mostly created for security-related initiatives or studies. However, there are many tools which are prohibited around the world due to their misuse. So, let's look at these amazing hacking tools. Even though they are dangerous and prohibited, yet they are easily available to purchase on Amazon. Hello and welcome to Tech4U. Today we will tell you about the 10 prohibited hacking gadgets from Amazon 2022. Before we start, go ahead and subscribe. Also, press the bell button to get the latest updates. Without any further delay, let's start. In the list of the 10 prohibited hacking gadgets from Amazon 2022 at number 10, we have USB Rubber Ducky. A USB Rubber Ducky hacking device is a necessity for any hacker. It is one of the top hacker tools. As a keyboard injection tool, a USB toolkit that may be used for penetration testing has been a hacker favorite since at least 2010. This dangerous utility allows you to inject backdoors and steal credentials. After being plugged into the victim's PC via USB, the rubber ducky can complete these tasks in a matter of seconds. You may build payloads on any text editor, such as Notepad or Nano, and USB rubber ducky runs on a script that is incredibly easy to program. The USB rubber ducky has a flash drive-like appearance and keyboard functionality. As this can be easily used for malicious purposes, it is prohibited to use at different places. Next on the list at number 9, we have Hacker F1. Great Scott Gadgets produced and invented the Hacker F1. One of the best hacking tools used by experts is Hacker F1. In essence, Hacker F1 is a radio communication device that uses software instead of conventional hardware to communicate. From a single peripheral that may be attached to the computer via a USB port, it is capable of processing various radio signals ranging from 10 MHAZ to 6 GHCDC. You people must be wondering right about now what purpose this tool serves. As a result, allow me to inform you that you can use Hacker F to sniff radio communications, send your own signals, and replay the signals you have recorded. This is an excellent radio hacking tool. You can easily purchase this tool from any hacker store, and it is also offered on Amazon. Next on the list at number 8 we have Raspberry Pi 4. Evan Hupton is the brains behind the Raspberry Pi. One of the better hacking tools is the Raspberry Pi 4, a fourth-generation single-board computer that is about the size of a debit card. It has numerous ports, including HEMI, DSI display, and USB 2.0 ports. Only a mouse, keyboard, SD card with an installed Linux distribution, and a power source through micro USB power input is required to complete the setup. The Raspberry Pi will thereafter develop into a full-fledged computer that is capable of running programs and engaging in any kind of ethical hacking. This hacking equipment costs only $35. One of the best things about this gear for hacking is that you may use a Raspberry Pi in places where laptops are not permitted. However, refrain from that mischief, lest you find yourself in serious difficulty. So make lawful use of the Raspberry Pi 4. Even though it is forbidden in many places, it is simple to purchase a Raspberry Pi 4 from Amazon. Next on the list at number 7, we have Wi-Fi Pineapple. Wi-Fi Pineapple is a collection of tools, hacking devices, used for wireless network penetration testing. The best hacker software in the world is this. It can launch an advanced man-in-the-middle attack, gather data about targets and networks, and capture GoVPA credentials in JTR or plain text formats, making it incredibly handy for many different types of attacks. It is capable of doing all of this using an intuitive online interface. The sixth generation of auditing platforms from Hack5 is the Wi-Fi Pineapple Nano and Tetra, created with consideration for both persistent and mobile deployments. Next on the list at number 6, we have Keylogger. You guys must be wondering why Keyloggers are on the list of hacking tools as they are outdated at this point. It is an old technique, but sometimes old is gold. Keyloggers continue to be crucial for hackers even though prohibited in many places. Hardware or software can be used as keyloggers. Keyloggers are primarily used to record keystrokes made on a device. A keylogger has the ability to screenshot your device, record keystrokes, and steal personal data as well as debit and credit card details. 
Keylogger software can also be used to hack a website to evaluate its security. Keyloggers are still dangerous then. Additionally, Keylogger hardware is offered on the Amazon online store. Therefore, you can purchase Keylogger hardware from Amazon if you wish to do so. Next on the list at number 5, we have Ubertooth One. With a speed of roughly 150 megabytes per second and a frequency of 2.4 gigahertz, Alpha continues to be the best at providing USB Wi-Fi adapters for penetration testing. This unique feature makes this device the greatest hacking tool. An IEEE 800 and 2.11 bits slash G slash an adapter, the Alpha AWS 036 NAID works well with other IEEE 800 and 2.11B slash G remote devices, but only at a speed of 50 megabytes per second. This adapter works with the Rallink RT3070 chipset and is effective with Kali Linux due to its attachment and play functionality. The 64-128-bit encryption level for distant information for WP, WPA, ADS, and so on is another eye-catching feature of this adapter. Next on the list at number 4, we have Proxmark 3. Proxmark 3 is a versatile radio frequency identification RFID device and one of the most effective hacking tools available. On our list of hacking tools, this is one of the top tools. Jonathan Westus created the hacking tool Proxmark 3, which allows for the reading, cloning, and sniffing of RFID tags. The Blue Shark Bluetooth 2.0 upgrade is another recent and attractive addition to it. It enables wireless control of the Proxmark 3 and the addition of an extra battery to create an autonomous Proxmark 3 that can be connected to and managed from your computer or smartphone. The Walrus NFC app has been updated to provide Bluetooth control. By including a metal cooler, it also addresses the high temperature concerns. Next on the list at number 3, we have LAN Turtle. One of the best hacker hardware tools is the LAN Turtle, a device for penetration testing and remote access that secretly connects to a USB port. Additionally, it enables the user to access the network for information. Additionally, it is capable of executing man-in-the-middle attacks via a straightforward visual shell. In short, the LAN Turtle is a clandestine systems administration and penetration testing tool that enables man-in-the-middle surveillance, stealth remote access, and network information gathering. Next on the list at number 2, we have MagSpoof. An amazing hacking tool called MagSpoof can mimic any appealing strike or debit slash credit card. Through the creation of an extraordinarily appealing field that mimics traditional attractive strut cards, it can operate remotely even on standard credit card readers. For the record, the MagSpoof website emphasizes that it wouldn't be possible to accomplish all of this with another person's credit card. Nevertheless, it's probably best not to bet against those people's endeavors. You can keep all of your credit cards and magstripes in one place thanks to it. Finally, on the list at number one, we have Adafruit Bluefruit LE Sniffer. With the help of a special firmware image, the Adafruit Bluefruit LE Friend may be used as a simple Bluetooth low-energy sniffer. Instead of constantly having to open the 2000-page Bluetooth 4.0 core specification, we can passively record data exchanges between two Bluetooth low-energy BLD devices and push the data into Wireshark, an open-source network analysis tool where you can visualize things on a packet level with helpful descriptors. That is all for today, folks. Tell us in the comments section what is your point of view about these amazing hacking tools and which one you like the most. See you soon with another amazing video.